Hello, my name is Dallas, and I'm back with more Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Uh, I'm not really sure what I have planned for this part. Okay, that looks like something I should probably go get immediately, though. I probably want to check out the southern side of the map, since I haven't really been over there at all. So I've got to find a rock near here somewhere. That's not what I'm looking for. I am not seeing one then. Unless I can take one of the outer ones and move it over. Nope. Is that it? There it is. Found it. Not. I think I do have enough to get another weapon slot if I wanted, so I want to kind of see what's at the end of that road there. That's kind of my first goal. So let's see where it goes off. That looks like another goblin fort. <laughs> I do think I need to go back to the stables because there was a shrine over there somewhere that I have to find. I also cooked up some stamina items before and so I can get to the top of that tower and maybe check out the other area. Okay, just a skull, so... I can go see what the chest has to offer and then work my way around somewhere. Oh, that's another Korok seed. Pretty close to the top. There we go. Yeah. Oh, that looks like another one. I actually don't know where that unless it's at the very top there and I have to like fight my way up to it. How's it going? Ow. That was rude. killed everything with the electric blast, so that's nice. Got it. I actually didn't know that that was a feature that would happen for that charge attack, and I guess it's good to know. Well, I probably want to get a picture of it at least, if not a great shield at least what I was looking at. Drop that for a minute. Yeah, it only has... Uh... 
so basically it's a really weak shield that can last a little bit longer. There we go. And I incidentally uh, killed everything here, so I guess that's one thing done. without making use of any of the explosive barrels. Uh, don't know if there's anything else over here though, which... It's kind of a shame. Okay, so now... I kind of want to see what's over in the water region over there, because... Uh, it's always good to check lakes, since I still have not found any fairy fountains. And it looks like another apple or another thing where I just can put in an apple and get another seed. They seem to be a lot of seeds just kind of packed around this area. Get an apple out. I got four right now, and I can take them all after I'm done, which is nice. I missed. I missed again. Okay. Got it. There we go. So apparently, this is turning into a seed farming session. Well, I'm not really sure what I if I can get two things of that. I don't think I have enough. I might just barely, but I kind of doubt it. by accident there. than they did. There we go. It's kind of really weird to get the angle for that. to be all of them. What did it get me? Yeah, bomb arrows. They're okay, but nothing particularly special. Let's 
So now I want to probably head southwest to check out that lake. And if there's nothing there, then I'll head back to the stables and maybe try to find that shrine. Or I can always kind of cut it and make my way back to the tower and just kind of show off what that reveals. bad time. Oh no. That's no good. Okay, gotta put away my metal. Probably can just unequip that, go for a wooden shield, and I probably don't want my bow on. Rough metal. Okay, no more electricity showing up. And that's another one down. Avoid the lightning relatively easily. Now, if it hits me at random, I'm gonna be kind of upset though. Is there really nothing over here? What is this? Or is it just kind of a transition area and they just kind of want to open it up with a lake? That appears to be the case. So I guess I can just go check out the fair and see over there. So this doesn't even seem to be a point on the map that's showing up named. So I guess there's nothing here. It's just a wide open area. And yeah, it's not even water. I just kind of thought it was based on what the map was showing me. could always use the shrine up there as kind of a look down, but uh, I probably don't need to. This is probably fine. And the reason that I need to go back to the stables is because there's a side quest there that I found while I was cooking, but I didn't want to activate it without actually kind of showing what the side quest was. Time to go check out the ferns. And there's another seed. Ah. Why is examine that? There we go. Okay, that's 13 now. Still don't really know how many I can eat. I need to get two. Uh, the ice to get it out of the water. I forgot about that for a minute. No. Opal. Okay. Fish over there if I want to get some extra oh, I'm spotted. I cannot catch them, I'm not fast enough, I need these bombs. Oops, that was the wrong button. 
Armored porgy, covered armor, hard skills, combat skills, and cooking dish, fortify bones and increase defense. I really should try to get into cooking more, or at least try to find recipes to use. It just seems like something that would be generally beneficial, and I kind of only really use it when it's convenient. And I can actually switch back at my gear now since it's not storming anymore. And let's go with that bow just to get it out of my inventory. So I don't think I've ever seen purple ones. Yep. I should probably heal now that I think about it. That one looks better. Oh, is that blue? Okay, be able one of his shoulder. Yep. Oh no. That wasn't what I wanted to do that. This is a bad time. Decent damage to him. I just barely hit that one, and that one just shot me in the back. One down. That's another down. Now I just gotta get the one who's shooting arrows, and it's probably a little bit easier. Since they don't tell me that's another rock formation that I gotta throw something in because that's way out of the middle of nowhere. And he's done. What's over here? Just to check to make sure that there's nothing like in the water there. Herbosa's fury is ready. Okay, I think I'm gonna go back and check out the side quest because there doesn't seem to be much of anything over here now. Unless there's something that I'm just blatantly missing, which is granted as possible. Yeah, I'll go check out the side quest and then I'll decide what I want to do after that. I think I want to head a little bit north of there and try to find the shrine. I think if I can at least get either the shrine or the tower, I can at least call this a successful part, because right now all I've kind of done is wander around and not get anything done. I 
I killed a fair share of monsters, but I mean, that's just kind of grinding in a game where grinding isn't even really a needed factor unless it's for specific ingredients. So I want to head this See the quest lady. Is that her? Hey. Let's heal up and then see if I can find it. Cause it doesn't look like the person who has it is either here or awake. And I needed heal anyway, so it's fine. There it is. Okay, so the thing that I accidentally did several, or like a couple sections ago, and I should just say a little while ago, I don't remember how long ago it was, where I just accidentally killed uh, the goblins who were riding around, now I just have to do it for me. That seems easy enough. Especially because it's just two bombs and they're done. that no oh he actually lived through that one that's impressive and now he's done now I guess I just gotta go turn that in I don't remember if it was the more solid colors they are the more like or the better the horses. I can't remember if that was the case. Uh, what do you have to say? Uh, nothing really important. A carrot. So I want to head a little bit north of here. Because I feel like in this section over here, there's probably a shrine just because it's across roads, which are usually pretty prominent. And then, like, that was also where I was getting a signal when I was walking by there earlier. Could probably take a quick glance from the top of this little mountain here just to see. don't see it and the beeping stopped is there like a cave on this mountain where it's like hidden or something I'm actually confused There just happened to be like the two that are relatively close together, and I just completely got them mixed together. Well, this looks ominous. Uh, some spicy peppers, but nothing else really major. I think 
after this shrine, I'm actually gonna do the tower just because it's relatively close and I have the items I need, so I might as well. There really isn't any reason for me to avoid doing the tower unless I just want to make a worse variation of stamina food for it. But I have several, so I can probably just pick the weakest one to use that or whatever will get me to the top. And my other main goal in general is, yeah, I have to get more shrines because I need both the stamina boost and also just the general heart boost so I can get the master sword. Ooh, a combat trial. Been a while since I had one of these. Yeah. So I guess I need my camera out just in case it's a guardian I don't have yet. It's a guardian scout too. Let's keep old picture. Oh hi. Pillar here. And that's another weapon down. I missed. And also, I want to switch my shield back. That's one I forgot to do. Probably use those just because I have three of them. I'm not too worried about it. Oh, I forgot that's the one where I have to glide in and slam down. I was thinking he was doing the laser face. And that's the end of him, so that uh, wasn't too bad. the only chest in here. I kind of doubt they'd hide one somewhere. At least I know how to check now, which is something I lacked in doing other shrines. A durability of boomerang, I guess. I guess I could take it. I don't really need the guardian sword. And it is admittedly better, and I should probably take a picture of it, because I don't remember if I have one yet. Nope, there we go. How many spirit orbs am I up to now? So I need three more, and then I should really turn those in, though. I'm kind of conflicted because it one, I want in. I don't. It's not really an immediate need that I have to do. On the other hand, it would mean that I get two extra hearts. I don't really know how many exactly I still need to actually get the sword. I just know I need as many as I can, and it seemed like increments of five were the way to go. Well, that's another shrine done. Er, Lake of the Horse God, that seems interesting. Maybe I should have just zoomed in like a long time ago and I would have actually been able to find a bunch of interesting stuff. No. 
Oh, I ran right into that one. make my way over to that tower. Oh, I'm tired. Let's see if there's anything worthwhile hidden here. A couple frogs and nothing too much. Oh, hi. Probably end it once I'm to the top of that. Ooh, he's got a quest. Forest dragon. Oh. Sure, why not? Oh. So there may be a dragon north that I can fight. That seems fun. A dragon shaped... Okay, so it's not fighting a dragon. Now I'm slightly... Dis that's where it is. So there's a shrine somewhere around there. Let's just do a marker there, just to sense that's where one is. So that's probably going to be my next stop after I get the tower. Where is the tower, by the way? It's a little bit far away, but I have to cross through an area I'm not really familiar with. Okay, my horse is too far away. Conveniently at the tower. Unfortunately, I am not at the tower. Is there any way that I can fast travel to it? No. Okay. Let's watch my stamina. Another traveler wander. Hi. Was that the one that I just got, or is there a different one? I think it's the woods that I'm coming up to. Oh, another Korok seed. I saw ya. Where did it go? Oh, there it is. There we go. happening. Oh, 
all the rupees. Okay, how close am I to the tower now? I'm getting pretty close, so not too much longer. Well, then I got the actual climb itself, which hopefully won't be long. sure I could get up here it's just a pain let me check the other way first it might be a little bit quicker <laughs> I guess not let's just go for it Worst case scenario, I guess I could try one of those stamina foods that I brought with me just to kind of try to get it over with. I don't really see any ledges that I can scurry over to in a worst case scenario, so if I do run out of stamina before getting to the top of this, I'll probably actually have to use food. But it doesn't look like that's going to be a problem. Just a little bit more. Okay, time to get this tower done so I can actually, like, oh. You know, so I can, uh, get a good handle on this area. jump because I think that burns more stamina than it's worth. Once I start to get around I think like the halfway point then I'll grab a little bit of food. Myself off, or not top myself off. I also made one of those. That gives me a little bit. Might just be enough to get what I needed. Because all I have to do is get to that ledge there and manage to make my way onto it. I think I was pretty close last time, I just didn't have that little bit of stamina. Yep, and I made it. Now just to uh, cross over the goal to the finish, and then I'll be done. There we go. That mountain looks kind of interesting. So I think in the next part I'm still going to keep kind of exploring like I have, except now I might actually be more precise since I decided to zoom.